Welcome back to Nicole's World. My name is Nicole C. And this is about to be the start of another vlog. If you are new here, please consider subscribing. I am almost to my first core to go. And you can be the one to push me there. So, to everybody else, how y'all doing? We're back with another vlog. It is Thursday. So, it's not really a weekly vlog. Like it, it can be whatever. It's a vlog, okay? It's just going to be a vlog. I'm starting this on Thursday because I have something special I want to show you guys. I have a busy weekend coming up. And... I'm still in the midst of work. I have my family coming to town again. My brother and his family, they come to town tonight. It is Thursday. They come to town tonight, and they leave an early Sunday morning. But in the midst of all that, I have drill this weekend. So Saturday and Sunday, I got to get up super early, go do Navy, play Navy, and then come back. We got family events happening Saturday and Sunday. So it's just like my head is in a whirlwind. Plus, physically, I'm just not here. I'm just not here. Ever since Thursday, last Thursday, my second session back with my trainer, I hurt my knee again. Um, but it wasn't that bad. Like, I felt it kind of tweak, but it didn't tweak all the way while I was working out that uh, Thursday. So, Friday, y'all know, I went to Myrtle Beach. I drove to Myrtle Beach. I think sitting in the car with my knee, like, in one position for so long, really just agitated. So, that whole weekend, my knee was just down bad. Um, then, yeah, so it's Thursday. So, it's been a week. My knee is still bad. Now, last night... This leg, my right leg, at the top, it's like a bone. Sometimes I can crack if I like move my leg a certain way. That thing just feel like it's going like bone to bone, which I know it's probably not bone to bone. I don't know what it is, but it just hurt when I press down on it. I'm like, what is happening to me? I'm about to be 35 in August, and I'm just sad at this point because am I really about to be the girl with the bad knees and limping around? Like, oh. So this morning I got up. I have a safety officer networking me in at 9 o'clock. It's 7.15 right now. Um, so I just got up, I did my makeup, I got dressed, like, I was like, you know what, whatever. I didn't even put on my, these lashes, and I usually don't wear these lashes to work, but we're not going to be inside a facility, we're going to be at a college out here, Christopher Newport University, just having, you know, a little safety networking meeting, so I was like, this is what y'all getting today. It's gloomy outside, it's going to rain all day, it's in the 70s, but I didn't know it was going to rain all day. But, yeah, so this shirt I got from Fashion Nova a while ago. These pants are from Kato. I'll show you guys one time. Let's see if I can step back. They got, like, the little buttons. They kind of high rise. They fit really cute. And I'm going to wear some, like, loafers with it. So, yeah, this is my work outfit for today. But let me stop complaining because it's been two minutes. None of y'all like, girl, we came here to have good vibes and fun. We don't want to hear about all this. But I just had to let y'all know the state of mind I'm in right now. Okay. Can I vent? Can I, can I just be real? Okay, can I stop feeling? Oh, I should have bought my... I'll show y'all the new perfume I bought. But I got a package. I got a package. Okay, so this made me happy. I wanted to open this last night. Why I get in the bed? Start looking through my camera because I always do. I look through my ADT cameras. I look at the same videos the other day. And the mailman had delivered me a package at 3.30. Mind you, I was right here at 3.30. So I didn't see that man or hear that man. And I don't know about the front ring, the, not ring, I got ADC. But the front doorbell camera never alerts me. But let somebody drive by in the back, alert, alert, alert. Let it ring, alert, alert, alert. I don't know why. I, I want to know who, at, who on the porch. Why do I have to go back and look in the same documents? But, so, this box is from, <laughs> looky here. My girl, Via Glow, check out her YouTube channel. She resells clothes and shit. <laughs> That's her slogan, y'all. She is hilarious. She cursed like a sailor. You know I love that. Uh, she's funny. And she resells clothes and shit. So she's like a resale to me, a resale guru. You know, all I do is put up clothes I don't like no more on Poshmark. She got multiple different platforms. It's a business for her. So she came out with some merch. And I got the hat because your girl love a good hat. It's like a distressed hat. And it says, I resell clothes and shit. And you have noticed, like, the eye is like a clothes. Like, it's like a shirt. So neat. The back strap adjustable. Because you know, sometimes we got weaves. Sometimes we got locks. Sometimes we got our real hair. So, I love me a good hat, y'all. <laughs> oh, my God. It fit perfectly over top of these locks. Baby. Period. This might be my thumbnail. 
Shout out to Via Glow, y'all. Check out her channel. Her vlogs are great, interesting. And like I said, she crushed like a sailor and she funny, y'all. Love her. Love her. Good quality. I wish I could wear a hat to work today. I should, because, you know, the other people, they don't be thinking. Like, they do what they want to do. Like, even yesterday, we had, like, a fit testing event. But I guess since we wasn't in a facility, you can wear blue jeans. But, like, wearing blue jeans is just, like, taboo where I work at because the other people that's there, not by choice, got to wear blue jeans. So, we can't wear blue jeans. So, when I see people with blue jeans, like, even if we, like, not in a facility, but we're still in a work capacity, I just be like, you ain't care today. But if I was like them, I would throw in my hat. But I can't because it say shit. I mean, it don't say shit, but it's insinuated shit. And you can't wear stuff like that. But anyway, y'all get the point. Love the hat. Y'all going to see this a lot. Check out her merch. She got t-shirts. At least she got hoodies. She got more hats, different colors. Go check her out via Glow. I'll, go, I'll, I'll link her um, channel description below. But yeah, that kind of made my morning. Well, my night yesterday when I got it off the porch, but I didn't open it. And yeah, quick shipping, fast shipping, professional, the way I like it. Um, Yeah, so we about to head on out of here. I literally could make breakfast here, but the way my mood set up, like I just want to, I just want to do things that I want to do today. So I'm going to go to Dunkin' because I got a $2 Dunkin' card. If you don't, if you have T-Mobile and you don't download T-Mobile Tuesday app on your phone, you leaving money on the table. So I think all month, this month, they give me $2 Dunkin' cards every Tuesday. So I'm going to go to Dunkin'. I'm going to get me, I don't want matcha. I need coffee. And that might be another thing, y'all. I have not had coffee, coffee in like nine, ten days. When did I last have a coffee? I have it. Oh, espresso martini don't count. Um, But that's the last time I had ca like coffee in that, that sense. Because the matcha got caffeine in it. But I need coffee. And I've been drinking green tea in the morning, like all week. I want coffee this morning. But I don't be liking Dunkin's coffee because it gives milk. Um, but I want to try that avocado toast. Decisions, decisions. But I'm going to see you when I get there because I've been talking to y'all half the death. It's 7.20. I'm kind of early. Yeah. I'm going to see y'all when we get in the car. All right, good people. We are in the car. And it's a good thing I came out here. Oh, they took. Oh, they must have came and took recycle. Um, because the dang trash truck. It must have been a recycle though. They was out here at 7.15, like 7.30, not 7.15, it had to be 7.30. And I be about to hit everybody trash can on my way out, like, moving out the way. But anyway, um, the dilemma is, do I take my work car or just drive my personal car? But, if it was a nice sunny day, I would take my personal car. But because it's just a rainy, gloomy day out, I don't think I'm a ghost do lunch after this training but i'm gonna be hungry after this okay and then the other dilemma is do i go to dunkin or do i go to starbucks because i have a two dollar dunkin card but i don't like dunkin coffee just don't be doing it for me so i have so many dilemmas i need to decide before i get on this main road starbucks or dunkin work car or no work car and i also need my little charger thing out of my work car so i'm gonna end up taking a work car I'm going to take the work car and go to um, Starbucks. Yeah, that's going to be the plan. That is going to be the plan. So, Because I just need the right kind of coffee. Especially if I ain't eating no breakfast. I need the right kind of coffee. So let me go to Starbucks. Should I go to Starbucks first or get the work car first? Because sometimes I don't like going... Yeah, I'm going to go to Starbucks first. Um, yeah. All right, I'll see y'all. <laughs> okay, so I'm in the midst of having a meltdown because I cannot find my debit card. Um, and I'm in a Starbucks line. And, of course, I could just... I could add the money to my Starbucks card because it's linked. But I don't know the password and it's not taking my biometrics. But I have another car I could use. But where is my car at? The last place I used it was at that seafood boy place. Y'all, I'm about to just pass. Did I leave my freaking car in there? And I was on the phone. See, that's what happened when I'm on the phone and I'm distracted. Oh my God, I'm about to pass. I'm about to have to go home because where's my car? Where would it be? You know what? It might be in my other bag because I had my 
work bag yesterday. I'm not even going to stress. I'm just going to have to swipe my other card. I'm going to have to swipe my other card. Yeah, because I went straight from work to the seafood ball place to home to film the video. So my card has to be in my work bag. But I need that. I don't want to be out here swiping this card all day. Because the only other card I got is my credit card. You know what? That's why I'm coming back here anyway. I'm coming back to... I'm taking my work car. Anyway, Lord have mercy. Like, come on, universe. Oh, y'all, I'm about to order this new um drink I found on TikTok. And it better be good and it better not be no damn $10. Because WCF. I cannot believe my card like no thank you can i have a venti ice chestnut praline latte with ice chestnut praline latte okay let me do the ice um which was the other one uh, thank you Y'all, I didn't get on these people nerves. <laughs> I didn't get on my own nerves, but I didn't definitely get on these people nerves today. So I'm gonna tell you what I ordered. I got an iced mocha latte with sweet cream cold foam and extra caramel drizzle. And that thing is nine dollars just to change. So here we go with this ten dollar drink. Y'all, I just need to go back to bed and reset my day. And I should have known the chestnut praline. That is a damn holiday drink. Y'all just 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 omit that. Delete this. <laughs> I think I go delete this. Delete that. Delete that. But yeah, my card. I almost want to go home, but I don't I'm not gonna have time. It's 8 16. I need to be at that place at 9. Yo. I might just drive and take my own car today because it's just giving I'm just having a chaotic day. My tank full. But I do have to go back and forth to um to drill this weekend so yeah I th i'm gonna just drive straight there because Port uh, newport news is like 30 minutes away and i don't want to be the late black person coming in so let me put this in this gps and let me start i'm gonna just drive my own car <sighs> y'all my day my day my day my day my day but it's gonna get better i want to see what this drink look like i found it off of tiktok so iced mocha. And I read it to her. And I know I got on her nerves, y'all. I know I got on her nerves. I'm sorry to this lady. I'm going to get her a tip. Well, I don't know if I can tip because you can't tip because I'm not using the app because I don't have no money on the app. She's sick of me. I got to tell her sorry, y'all. She probably like, bitch, you didn't get out my drive through I look good, but I ain't doing good. It's an illusion. All right. Let me see. These people are sick of me. Sick of me. Say, what do you call a bear with no teeth? I don't know. That's a little riddle they got on there. Yeah, so I definitely gotta go now because 8 50. I'll literally just be getting there at 9 o'clock. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna just drive my own car. I don't got time to be going to go get the other car, but I wanted my little charger thing out of that car. I'll get it later, y'all. The day is getting away from me. Hello, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Good. It can I have a straw if you don't mind. Look at it, y'all. It's pretty. Oh, it's messy. And a napkin if you don't. Yeah, you. I'm sorry. It just got the caramel thing on there. I'm just a mess today. Thank you so much. Oh, I can have a receipt. I like to scan it in my fetch app. Thank you. Have a good one. Um Y'all, I'm just a mess. I'm just a mess. I'm just a mess. I'm just a mess. Hold on. We just gonna be late. I mean, I ain't gonna be late, but I'm gonna get there right on time. So. <clears throat> okay. They got caramel all over the dang thing. Like, you ain't see that when you handed it to me? You ain't see that. You ain't see that. But y'all, it looks so pretty. It is a venti iced white mocha with vanilla sweet cold from and caramel drizzle. So go ahead and try it out. I'm looking at me telling you to try something out before I even try it. Ain't nobody behind me. And I really be thinking I'm starting my day and I'm on time and don't. All right, let's go. I've been up since 5 
Oh, no, I got up at 6. I set my alarm for 5.30 and then I changed it. But let's try this. Let's try not to get hit by cars. Oh, it was somebody behind me. I couldn't see you for this. And, of course, this GPS be on silent night. Oh, can I just turn? Oh, good. Okay, I can turn. Right? Or no? No, I can't. Which way am I supposed to go? I hate... Look at the GPS and y'all tell me which way I'm supposed to go. It's no way to go straight. It's literally you got to cross two lanes of traffic. Um, so... Yeah, but I'm pretty sure it wants me to get on the freeway. Right, let's see if that was the right way. Yep, and then go on London. All right. Why is not talking? I hate when I do that, y'all. I know I'm giving somebody anxiety because I be getting anxiety when I watch people vlog in their car. So I know I'm giving y'all anxiety because I'm driving like, I don't know what I'm doing. But anyway, okay, let's taste this drink and then I need to focus on the road and get my mind right. Let's sip it, sip it. Nine dollars later. Nine dollars thirty-eight cent later. This thing keep moving. Mmm. Mmm. It ain't cold. You gotta get cold. Mmm. The flavors is flavoring, but it gotta get cold. All right, y'all. I gotta go. I gotta focus on the road. And the damn cup is sticky. All right, y'all. I'm here. Oh, here we go. Visitor parking. It's, it's hard to find parking. Visitor parking only. No open parking. You know how, um... Oh, it's right here, too. You know how colleges be with they damn parking. Like, I'm parking right here. And you know why I remembered? Why? I need to put uh, money on my... This is like visitor parking to me. What are they going to do to my car? It's a visitor and I'm on this side, so. Y'all hear that damn rain? Oh my God. Like, the day is just not day in the way I need it today. Which door can we go through? Where's the door? Where is the door? Oh my God. If I got to walk out here in the rain, y'all. I do. All right, let me go inside. Jesus Christ. All right, y'all. Safety meeting. The networking meeting was very good. It was so good to get out and like see people and network and talk. It's still raining out here like crazy. I'm about to take this in here. I'm gonna see if they can roll this neckerchief for me too. Uh, hopefully they can do this and get it back to me. It is the busiest time right here because I'm by the base. And it's lunchtime, so I'm in Norfolk. I need to get back to Portsmouth. And then I'm gonna have lunch. I think I'm gonna go to, um, Oh, guys, like that rain coming down. I think I'm gonna go. I think you pay when you come back. Uh, I think I'm gonna go to the corner and have lunch. But I'll probably stop at home first because I really want to get my debit card. I don't want to keep using this credit card. Even though when I get home, I just transfer the money. This freaking rain is coming down again, y'all. And this coat is not for rain. Lord have mercy. And I'm really thinking I need to get a massage. I think that's half of my problem. Is that I need a massage. Alright, let me go inside. Look at me in this coat. Lordy. Alright. y'all we're going to Target get a couple things if I can only come here and not have to go to Kroger that would be great so let's see This is usually $80 and it's $39. I have to get it. Y'all know I burnt my other comforter. I gotta get it while it's here. I gotta put me first, Lucius. I gotta put me first. I did not come in here for that. Y'all, I done been all over the place. Well, not really. I just feel like I have. I'm ready to go home. I have one last stop. I'm gonna go into Kroger because Target didn't have any 
uh, charcuterie boards. They did have one, but it had salami. Um, they need to make other options. I don't know if I'm close over in the other lane or he close to me. But this is a big ass truck beside me. But anyway, I'm gonna go in Kroger get some get a charcuterie board. Hopefully, they got the pre-made ones. If not, I don't know what I'm gonna get. But I like to have a little refreshments out when uh, when I have people coming into town or whatever. And my brother loves charcuterie boards. And since this is his, like, they celebrate his birthday this weekend, too. I just want to, you know, make it all good. And I got, um, I'll show y'all what I got. And I'm going to put in a little bag or basket for him. Like a welcome slash birthday gift thing. Y'all, I'm sleepy. I'm going to get home. I'm going to see y'all when I get home, child. Finally, I am home, y'all. I am tired. I'm ready to go to sleep. And I decided that this is only going to be a daily vlog. It's going to be a spend a day with me vlog. And that's it. And yeah. And I'm going to run y'all back with two more videos. Two more mukbangs and another vlog next weekend. But this weekend, it's really, I'm not going to record a lot. I'm going to be around my family a lot. And I have drills. So I won't even like be from 5 in the morning when I get up at 5.30 until 4 in the evening. I will be on drill. So that's most of my day. But anyway, let's get into this haul right quick. I got to stop looking at myself and look at y'all. Uh, I'm going to show y'all what I got from Target right quick. And then, yeah, so I got this, what is it called? Crematic? Crematic? How do you say it? Y'all get what I'm trying to say. Little placeholders or whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm going to put this on my vanity and my... My, my bathroom, my uh, owner suite, and I'm going to put my perfumes in here. I think they will all fit, and that just will look better than it being right on the cabinet. It was only $3. It was only $3. Um, yeah. Baby wipes, of course. That's for the guest bathroom. Um, like I told you guys, it's my brother's birthday coming up, so I'm making him a whole little birthday bag. I got him some. I'll just come back when I build up his whole bag but i got him some cologne and i got him a sparkling cider and i'm just making a whole little bag of it this is for the guest bathroom so i wanted to usually the only thing i got in my guest bathroom as far as like body washes and stuff is nothing i just get them like dove soap that's it so i wanted to put some face wash in there and y'all let's see what else i got for them and some um body wash so just in case people don't have it they'll have it they'll have face wash Face wash, body wash, they'll have their essentials. And I haven't smelled this one. Mm, smell it. Don't it smell good? I use the one that says smells like a rain shower. That's the one I have. Yes. That stuff smells good. It lathers good. Your whole bathroom, your bathroom is going to smell good. Then I just got some napkins. It's like recycled napkins. I was just looking at the price and the thickness of it worked for me. Um, then I got... Oh, these will be for my lunches while I'm on drill. I'll have salad for lunch instead of eating out. I'm sorry. Is it like too much of a glare? Yeah, so I'll have salads for lunch instead of eating out on Saturday and Sunday for lunch. So that's for drill because usually I'll be going to Wendy's or some fast food on base. I don't want to do that. Let me adjust this light because it's giving very bright. Is that better? That's better, okay? I was super bright, studio bright. Um, and then I got some oranges, because that'll be salad, orange. And then I'm going to cut one of these up and make some infused water. I like to also do that when they come. I think y'all saw that in the vlog before. But when I have guests coming or anything, I like to set up my uh, water pitcher thingy. And I'm also going to put this in his gift bag. Or I might lay these on a guest room bed for uh, my brother and his wife and my sister-in-law. Or I might put this in his bag. Like, put it all together and just let him know, like, y'all can pop this little cider. Y'all can do face masks tonight or whenever. And just take all a good little night. So, I'm going to put that in the bag as well. Or I might just lay it on their bed. On a guest room bed. I don't know. Then, I have... I never tried the Calafia Farms, but it's a cold brew. I'm going to need this for the weekend, so I'm not going to Starbucks every morning. But I could just start my day with some coffee. That's going to be that. I'm not going to eat breakfast. It's super early when I, I got to go on drill. So I'm just starting my day with coffee, nice iced coffee. Calafia Farms. I like um, unsweetened medium roast. And let me tell you, that coffee this morning, it tasted good. 
but it was giving milkshake vibes. Like, that's for people that don't like coffee. I like coffee. I want to taste coffee. I don't want to taste all that creamer and foam. Ugh. I won't buy that again. It wasn't nasty, but it wasn't what I needed. Um, then, y'all, I told y'all about my bones and stuff this morning. So, I got some calcium. And I like taking gummies. Oh, could y'all even see that? I like taking gummies. It's adult calcium, 500 milligrams. It's bone support. I don't know why I didn't already get this. And I don't know why my doctors didn't tell me to get this. Well, maybe because I'm not calcium deficient. But I just feel like they're going to help. Two gummies per day. Let me take two right now. Because I love me a good gummy. Um, but hopefully this helps, y'all. Because, like, today, like, my other knee, I'm just a mess. Like, I don't know if it's because I rushed back into it. But I was working out on my own. When I took that month off, when my trainer had to take that month off. So I don't know why I was like, I don't know. I don't want to say it's because we hit it too hard and didn't like ease into it. But my body, and then now I'm feeling like a little tweak in my back when I turn. So, yeah. I don't know why they make stuff so hard to open. I'll take two of these right now. And... I'm adding this to my uh, my little uh, vitamin regimen. I already take a multivitamin every morning. Mmm. Mmm, look at them. Hopefully this helps. Because I'm going to start taking these every morning. Or at night. I heard somewhere that you're supposed to take your vitamins at night. Because while your body is digesting and doing everything. Um... Then, this is the items I got from, that's all I got from Target. Then, this is the gift bag we're going to use. This is the tissue paper I'm going to use. Because I was re I was using my old bag. So, that'd be saving gift bags people give me. Then, when they come, I just want to put out, like, little treats and stuff. So, I have some chips. Tortilla chips. Um, this is going to go with the orange. So, it's going to be mint and orange infused to water. And... So I'm gonna put I'm gonna show y'all how I put all of this out as far as the little snack. Um something sweet. So just some chocolate chip cookies. I'm gonna put those out. And I have the salsa for the chips, just mild cantina style salsa. And then I'm gonna put out the cocktail shrimp. So I'm gonna put all of that out. I'm gonna show y'all how I set it up. It'll be a whole shebang. Right now, I'm gonna get me some water because I have not been drinking enough water today. Go change into something comfortable. Come down here. I'll make the infused water now. And yeah, just put stuff up. That's what I'm going to do, y'all. And I'm going to come back and show y'all how I set everything up a little later. And we'll wrap it up tonight. So I'll see you guys once I just as he compress for a minute. See ya. I almost forgot to show y'all the blanket up close and personal, but this is the blanket I got. It was on sale for $39.50 with taxes. It was like $42. Y'all, this usually sells for $79. And it comes with um, decorative flange, machine washable, shams with zipper closure. So I am going to wash this. So it's one standard comforter and two shams i'm going to wash this y'all but i am not going to dry it this time i have learned my lesson or i'm going to put it on air fluff if you didn't see that last vlog where i burnt the last nice ass white comforter i got from tj maxx then you understand but i'm about to go wash that i'm so excited to put it on my bed y'all my house is coming together but okay let me start getting ready bye, -bye. all right i wanted to show y'all what i'm doing right quick as far as this little thingy so I'm going to place y'all down here so y'all can see the vision. And, oh, I got to tell y'all about a new perfume I got. It's by Paco Rabanne, and it's called Lady Million. Now, this smells like a very sophisticated, got her ish together, can't tell me nothing type of woman. And that's what I am. So, period. But it smells good. It's a 1.7 ounce. I got it at the outlets when I went to Myrtle Beach. That was a clip that I left out of the whole video was um me showing you guys what i had got but it smells really good and i really just fell in love i also like how the container look and i'm gonna show you like it don't stand up like it do that little tilt so let me bring y'all down so y'all can see what i'm trying to do yeah so if you hear a loud noise that's my washer going um i'm washing the the comforter okay so i want to put this obviously not gonna fit oh it could fit but then I won't have space for this stuff. So I'm going to leave this off and I'm going to do it like that. Hey, like that. And then I have these two. And then I could put 
this on here as well. Yeah, and my Fenty skincare. Uh, the Fenty is, the Fenty not making it look glam, so the Fenty won't go over there. But this can. How does that look, y'all? I'm going to show y'all once I set it up. This big old um, body lotion. Too big to kind of fit. Oh, but now what would I do with this big old thing? It's still going to have to sit right here. Or should I just move this? Okay, I'm going to show y'all how it looks. Let me know what y'all. What do you think? I don't know where else to put this. And over here... We got to do something with that. If you got any problems with like your gums bleeding or anything, um, I showed y'all that in a vlog though, but uh, my or my dentist prescribed me that. But since then, my gums do not uh, bleed when I floss. And I think it was because I wasn't flossing enough too. But yeah, tell your doctor you want that, your dentist. Uh, so what do y'all think about this part? What do you think? What can I do with this? That mic can fit on there. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. If I move this stuff over here, it just ain't gonna get the shine that it was getting. Um, let's see. Yeah, this taking up half the space, but that don't look too bad like that, huh? But where's this gonna go? No. Yeah, that ain't gonna work. This one is so big. Uh, all right, we're taking that back off. Y'all get the point. Y'all get the point. I'm about to just... That's what I'm trying to do over here. So, I'll see y'all later. Ooh, I'm all in y'all face. Anyway, so I changed clothes right quick. Um, Yeah, so I was going to show y'all what I got for my brother. Now, I was trying to recycle and reuse the... Um, let me go back like this. I was trying to recycle and reuse the um the bags I, I had previously had so yeah i was just using this polo bag but i was like yeah okay so i'll show you what i got him and how i'm gonna pump the bag up i decided to put those face masks on the bed in there so they could just see them and use it but i got him some versace euros cologne it smelled really good the other man like was a man that was helping me and uh, my friend was with me and he said it smells really good and he likes the smell. I like the smell. So I'm going to give him that. And the sparkling cider I showed you guys. And what I'm going to do with the sparkling cider is, and I have the gift bag, so I think y'all would rather see that than me right now. I'm just show y'all how much. This damn tripod is just weak in the knees. Like, why is it doing that? Hold on, y'all. I'm going to edit that out. It's not standing up. Like the legs. What is happening? Oh, I think because I got it too high up, maybe. Okay. I just want to show y'all what I'm doing uh, as I pack this bag. So. Here's the bag. Let me go back some more. Hold on. This is ghetto. I know. Bear with me. I'm not a professional. Anyway, so show you what I'm about to do. So, pop the bag up. And I do have this bubble wrap, and I'm gonna put it in the bottom just to like cushion everything. And then just got the white. And I have on this shirt. I showed this in the last vlog that I got from um from the thrift store when I was first day. What I'm gonna do with the bottle is like this. Like just wrapping around, kind of. I had a vision in my head. We'll see if it works out <laughs> for what I want to do with this and how I want to put it in here. Do so y'all care if y'all don't see my face? I don't think y'all care right now. I just want to show y'all what I'm doing. I think you need to see my face. There we go. And then put that in the bag. Oh, I need like a. I do got ribbon upstairs, but what I'm gonna do? I'm just be creative and use this. The tie it. Y'all gotta be innovative, okay? Innovative, and it look real rustic, right? Yeah. Tie this around it. And masculine. I want it to look masculine. I have so many gift bags upstairs, but um, yeah, just tie this around it. 
Yo, this looks neat. See? <laughs> Somebody said ghetto. <laughs> I say it's recycle, reuse, and reduce. So see, cute, cute, cute. I'm gonna put that inside with the bubble wrap, and then I'm also gonna wrap up the. Cause I like the fact, like when people give me gifts, like I gotta get to it. So I'm gonna wrap that up nice and cute. Y'all, I'm not a wrapping type of person. I don't know. Yeah, I suck when it comes to holidays. And I put that right here. Also on a bubble wrap. And then, of course, you're going to take the tissue paper and make it come out of the bag like that. Easy peasy. Um, I don't think I'm going to make the... Uh, I need to sit down for a little bit, y'all. I'll make the infused water. Uh, closer than when to when they're here and yeah voila that's the gift bag boom oh yeah it looked like that on the other side so yeah let me raise y'all back up if this thing gonna act right just so y'all can see me i know y'all very good I know. I know. i'm not a professional i'm not a professional yeah so i'm about to relax and I will come back when I'm setting out the little hors d'oeuvres and the infused water. But right now, I just got to go like, eh. And I saw people post their blogs and videos. So I'm going to catch up on some video. Just relax for a little while. I'll get back up in a little bit and do the rest of the little stuff I have to do. But I will see you guys. All right. So I am back. I, t I ain't take no nap, y'all. I probably closed my eyes for like 10 minutes, 5 minutes. But I did get a little, you know, just lay down on the couch a little bit. But my sister-in-law called and said she's about an hour, oh, they're about an hour away. So I went ahead, I'm trying to look and see what that is. Is that a seed from the, that's a piece of the orange. Okay, I'm going to fish that out because it don't look too appealing. But I'm going to show y'all what I did. It wasn't too much. I could not find a charcuterie board. And it's hard to find charcuterie that does not have pork. And they don't eat pork. I don't eat pork. And I just put out a little finger foods, y'all. <laughs> it's not my best. And the shrimp are still frozen. You're supposed to thaw them out overnight. So I'll just pan around and show you guys what I did. Or what I set out. Because I told y'all I was going to show y'all what I set out. So basically, I just set out. Let me take y'all off so y'all can actually see. So I set out like a little... What do you call this? Like finger, like snacks. There you go. A couple of snacks. So I got some cookies, some pita chips, some tortilla chips. And over here is some salsa. These are like pickles, like um, garlic and all kind of other stuff on the pickles. I got them from Aldi. And then I just put a whole pickle in there. Just, I don't know. <laughs> and then I put some grapes. And then if you come down here, you have your napkins, your plates, and your toothpicks. Um, and then I infused. I did the orange and mint. I was looking at this, but I think that is a piece of the orange. But I'm going to take it out. So that's some nice refreshing water. I have wines right here. I have some more wine in the refrigerator. This is some Tito's, and I have more Tito's over there. And, yeah. So, I'm going to set up the hookah. I don't think I'm going to light it yet. I might light it now. I don't know. Um, but I'm going to get the hookah ready. I'm going to go freshen up myself. And I will be the hostess with the mostess for the evening. I don't know if they already ate dinner yet, but I have leftovers, but they know I'm not a cooking type of person. I rarely cook for myself, so I'm sure they either got the kids something to eat already, or they're planning to order, or maybe even go out. But this is just some little snacks. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this spend the day with me today. We did a couple of things. You saw me go to work. You saw me have late lunch you saw me do a little shopping and yeah just at home um so i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog i will be back next week on my new posting days again once again are wednesday friday and sunday so y'all will see me on wednesday with another mukbang if you did not see last week's videos then go look at my last mukbang from friday go look at my mukbang from wednesday and go look at my blog from last sunday so you're all caught up with the things that's going on and guess what y'all i didn't want to mention this because it's just the way, like, YouTube be working sometimes. But I'm at 502 subscribers. Yay! So since I've been consistent this year, my goal was to reach 500 subscribers within the first quarter of the year. So I did that. Thank you so much to everybody who's watching this who has subscribed to my channel. I am sorry. I am shaky. 
Um, I was just holding the phone. Um, so grateful to everybody that subscribed to my channel. I cannot thank you more. Um, yeah, we're gonna grind this thing out. We're just getting bigger and better. Like, next time y'all see me, I'm gonna be doing a room reveal because I'm changing out my Zen room to more like an office slash YouTube filming sitting down room. So, y'all gonna see that. I have plenty of stuff coming from Amazon to get the staples in that room to how I want it, and then we're gonna tweak it from there. So, there's much more to come, you guys. Thank you so much, and I will see you guys next time in the clothes world.